Hey guys, it's me, Bernie from All About G, and in this uh, quick tutorial, we're gonna have a look at how to remove a green screen from an image. And therefore, I've taken a picture from of me in front of a green screen, and now we're trying to remove it. And we're doing it uh, with two different ways. So I'm just deleting my original layer to show both. The first is to use the magic wand, so forget the magnetic lasso. And we're simply hitting the areas we want to select by holding down the shift key to extend our selection. And it looks already very good, uh, except for the hair up here, but I don't care. I'm just deleting it or we could do better. We could create a mask, invert the mask or first invert the selection, then create the mask. We are gonna delete this section as well. And voila, our green screen is removed. Method number two, we are gonna use the select menu. We are gonna select our layer here and hit select color range. And we have to select our color we want to be selected, in this case green, but you see we have some bright green up here, we have a darker green in the shadow, and in the little dialog window you see what is about to be selected, so white is selected, black is not selected. To extend a selection, we could use the eyedropper with the plus uh, icon, or by simply holding down the shift key to extend a selection. And if I've done something wrong, like now, I can simply hit the green again and start all over. So I'm gonna select all the areas that I want. So up here we are good. The shadow is good. So this looks pretty nice. I see some small white dots already down here on my t-shirt, but I don't care. Just saying okay. And now we are inverting the selection by Control Shift I and now creating the mask. We're gonna box select this one here, delete it from the mask. And it looks pretty good. So now we can look at our mask. I have some problems in here. So I could simply use our brush tool using complete white and I'm gonna extend it, make it some harder. And I'm gonna fix this one here. So by holding down and I'm painting it so it looks a little bit better now. So we have those two results. And the main difference is, you see, especially when using the wand, we have some sharp edges and when using the color selection, we have soft edges, but we also have some errors. So we maybe have to adjust our mask manually by using, for example, a soft brush, make it a little bit smaller and simply fix this one so we could remove the greens here and stuff like that. But I guess that's a little bit too much doing that now because I want to focus on another problem which you get with both methods. And this is this green tint that you see up here. So it's not only uh, caused by the selection and we didn't use a feather or stuff like that, but it's also the reflection we get from the green screen. You can see this especially here on the glasses. We have pretty much of the green reflections up in the hair. This will be another topping in another tutorial. But now we want to remove this, this green tint all over. So here we also have it on the skin. And therefore, I'm using an adjustment. It's a hue saturation adjustment. I'm gonna use the clipping layer function and go down to greens. And here we can select my area. So by default, it's perfect green. But I want to select my own green. And this is this dark one here I want to select. And now I can just shift down the hue a little bit. So you see the green is vanishing and turning into a more yellowish color. And I can also put down a saturation to make it look a little bit better. And the next thing I want to do is just adding another adjustment layer, also going to the greens here. And I want to remove the screen, which is on the skin. Should have shaved. And we're going to select it. And now we can also try doing this, but it's also, it's a pretty complicated because you see we're also touching the yellow area here so we can manually adjust this a little bit by moving these sliders and check if we can remove it and you see with a little bit of tweaking i've now removed the complete green tint that i had on my skin and on my glasses so to make it before and after this is before this is after and that way you can remove your green screen if you liked the video you can hit the subscribe button hit the like button and see you next time